What's happening, good people? My name is Doug, and this is Thaber Media. Today, we're going to talk about Udio and how they just went to a subscription model. The good times are over. No more free 1,200 credits per month. Now we've got to pay for it. Well, actually, there still is a free tier. We'll, we'll get into that in a minute. But here's my question for you guys today to be thinking about and percolating while I talk about the subscriptions and some new features that they rolled out. Now that it's not free, it's still in beta, but you do have to pay. So now that they've moved to this model, are you planning on paying? Are you going to stay on that free tier? Or are you going to walk away now that, the, now that you have to pay for it? I would love to hear what you've got to say about that. So drop the line in the comments and let me know. At the end of the video, I'll talk about where I am with this. Let's jump into it. Okay, folks, I've jumped over to the Udio announcements page on their website, and you can see that they have introduced subscriptions this week and in-painting, which I think audio in-painting is a very interesting concept. I mean, we're taking the in-painting concept from digital art and now applying it to audio. So that's going to be interesting to see how that works. We pop open the tiers here. See, there is still a free tier for the free tier. 10 credits a day with 100 extra each month standard processing queues, and up to two concurrent generations. So you're getting four tracks out of that, but two concurrent generations. And of course you get your Remax and your extended uh, tracks. You can do those things with it. Jump over to standard where you're getting 1,200 credits a month with no daily limits. You get priority processing in the queues, up to three concurrent generations, which is six tracks. I think the maximum we could get during the free beta was two concurrent generations. And you get the in painting, custom cover art, and custom user avatars. That's pretty cool. And for the pro plan, 30 bucks a month, 4,800 credits. You get your priority processing in the queue, up to four concurrent generations, which will give you eight tracks at, at once. And of course, you get all the features of the standard plan, which jumps back over to in painting, the custom cover art, and the custom avatars. I've got some comments on the initial video I put up for the Udio subscriptions and in painting review that I did. Some folks were able to help me out and point out exactly what was going wrong with that. Took a few of you and I appreciate that because it takes a village around here. Human error. Absolutely. Transparency is important to me. So I want y'all to know I unlisted the initial video. It's still floating around out there. If you have the link to it, you can still get to it. I'm re-uploading this with the new edit. But just want to let you guys know that. Thanks. You guys are awesome. I have song lyrics here. We're going to use these top two lines in the verse. These are what we want to change. If I try and change them at the same time, it's going to be a problem. Found that out in the last video. But I want to do more than just do line by or word by word. We don't need to do that either, though. We can do about a line or so each time. It takes a little bit of tweaking, though. Once you get into your edit, you want to go to in paint. You're going to see something that looks like this. What you want to do is take this top line here. These two lines are very, very important. I realize this. There's a couple of things here that are very important. I was focusing solely on this bit of region lyric notes down here and thought that's all I needed to do, which is not correct. You got to get everything lined up correctly and not try and do too much at once. So here's what we're going to do. I know the lyrics I'm looking for. This keeps pulling out the tide, that melancholy moon, which should read that melancholy moon keeps pulling out the tide. That's the way it should read. It was written incorrectly. Now, in this, it keeps going through it wrong. We're going to fix it in Udio. You want to move your lower slider and your upper slider to the same area. I know my song lyrics are right around 32. That's where I'm going to take this to 31. I'll put it at 31. And I'm going to get this aligned underneath it. So now we have the shaded region which is going to be where the work is. And we have this second region here. You can do up to four of these at a time. I'm going to stay simple with this particular edit just to show you what you can do and how it does actually work and work properly. Just don't get too carried away with it and try and replace an entire verse or multiple lines at a time. Got this selected. Now I can go down here and follow these instructions. When in painting, use asterisk, asterisk, asterisk to enclose the lyrics you want to in paint, plus one to two extra lines on both sides. You can highlight text and press tab to quickly select an area. It says, I'm going to highlight them all because I can't really go above, even though it says one or two lines on both sides. I can't go above it because this is the first line. Then I'm going to hit tab. Now check out. 
you see here down here in the red you are missing the asterisk 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 selectors from your text which are required for in painting try highlight one or two lines in the area around you want to change and press tab i've done that press tab my warning goes away i have my lines now enclosed there i'm good there i do need to go and change this line now so i'm going to go ahead and back it out Control v put in that line now i've got everything lined up here it's enclosed in the asterisks i've got both of these region markers here in the appropriate areas they're enclosing what i need to tweak all i'm going to do is hit now and now is hit create so just a quick recap we were able to go from this pulling out the tide that melancholy moon to this oh, melancholy moon that melancholy moon and then finally we got both of the lyrics transposed the way they're supposed to be and we get this oh, melancholy moon keeps pulling out the tide Things that I try to hide. What's right for you? Is any of it right for you? For me, personally, I really like what Udio is doing. I'm enjoying creating with this AI generative music. It's very interesting to see where things go. And I'm very impressed with the way things sound today. And I know that things are just going to continue to get better, much just like, just like AI generated video. Things are going to continue to get better. I honestly feel like I don't have to go through as many generations to get a decent sound versus when I'm trying to create with AI generated video. This is a lot quicker, a lot more, a lot more rewarding with a lot fewer generations. Still got to throw a few generations out there to put something together decent, but nowhere near what you have to do to create something visually stunning as far as videos go. So with that, here's what I'm saying. The standard is for me. Your all's miles may vary. I'm enjoying what I'm doing. I hope you're enjoying what I'm doing here. Give me a like, give me a share, give me a comment. If you're enjoying what I'm doing and want to come along for the ride, I love the comments. You guys are amazing in your comments. Thank everybody that's come on board recently. Tell your friends, let's make some music together. Till next time. Thanks, everybody.